He was the center of attention Thursday afternoon at an Eldoret court. Renowned steeple chaser Ezekiel Kimboy appeared before Principal Magistrate Francis Kiyamba. Kimboy has been charged with the alleged assault of Anjuri on Wednesday night. And just as he had denied the charges in court, the former Olympic gold medalist maintained his innocence outside the courtroom. <laughs> kwa sababu ilikuwa inanyesha na au wakora wakaipatia statement yao ya kusema kwamba mimi ndio niliwapamia Alia in the day 26 year old Anjeri Otieno who spoke to journalist in her hospital bed had claimed that she had been Kimboy's friend for 2 weeks now she maintains she was stunned by the athlete allegedly after declining to his advances she admitted they had been enjoying an evening out at a local pub within the town so when we figured our place he stopped the car, and then I told him good night, like thanks for the night. Then he was like, okay, you're not going anywhere. You can't leave me like this. He opened the car, came out, and then opened my door using his key, and then he pulled me outside. But I couldn't manage. He came back and told me today you'll know who I am, and then he stabbed me. He stabbed me on my chest. The incident happened on Wednesday night at West Indies Estate in Eldoret Town. But what happened after the two left the entertainment joint now depends on investigations to determine the direction of the case. Kimboy was in Nairobi on Wednesday, during which Tim Kenya visited State House, where it received the national flag from President Mwai Kibaki. Tim Kenya is supposed to be camping in Kasarani for the London Olympic Games. Kimboy was released on a cash bail of 20,000 shillings. Ezekiel Kimboy may be safe to participate in this year's July-August Olympics, as his case will be mentioned on the 25th of September this year. Masi Kandi reporting for KTN at the Eldoret Law Courts in the county of Wasingishu.